Well, we have arrived to our spot here in, uh, it's close to Port Clinton, Ohio. It's called Camp Perry. It's a military campground, and this is an Air National Guard base. And um, so they do training every once in a while. We've been here in um, some gunfire, some ranges where they're doing some training. Oh, I said the G word. They're probably gonna, YouTube's gonna hate me now. I said the G word. Can't say that on YouTube. But there was, I had this weird thing going on. Well, first of all, let me show you the spot. It's a nice spot, concrete, back in. It goes all the way back here so we can fit the RV and the truck. It's nice and flat, paved on the spot. I mean, the utilities are, are, are pretty weird. The uh, sewer is way up here, and then the water back there, and then the power pedestal is even further back there. But we have this big open area on our non-living side, so that's nice. Garbage is very conveniently located right there for us. And then on the other side, we have, uh, we have a decent little space here with the picnic table and uh, no neighbors here yet. And it's pretty wide open out here. We had this weird thing happen. Ever since we got here, we've been hearing these bangs on the side of the RV. And I'm like, what is that? Something's banging on the side of the RV. And so then I looked in the, I was looking out this window here, up in the hallway. And I'm watching birds fly into the side of the RV, just wham. So I come outside and I'm like, what is going on? But here's the thing, you got these little bugs. Now you can see these guys. If you walk up here, they're everywhere. Leslie sprayed, but I mean, she sprayed the grass. So I'm guessing that's why they're up on the RV. So what's happening is the birds are just flying in here and just wham. And they'll hit the RV, grab a bug, and then fly back off. So every once in a while we're here and I was thinking they were just flying into the side of the RV and I was like, man, I hope these birds are okay, but they're not actually flying full steam into it. They're actually going up there and then their beak is hitting the, the RV because they're grabbing a bug and then they're flying off. But this is gonna be a nice spot. We're close to uh, Sandusky, Port Clinton, um, Cedar Point. I don't know if we're gonna go to the amusement park or not, but we, are, we got some friends coming down to see us, uh, visiting from Canada. So we're gonna have a good time here. And we're here for one week, and then we're headed over to Elkhart for the Alliance Rally. Well, today we're going through a drive through safari. We've done a couple of these since we've been on the road, but this is a different one because it has like an interactive dinosaur thing over here. So we're going to get in here, we're going to buy some tickets, and then we're going to go through the drive through portion. And then there's a walk-through portion too, where you can pet the animals. And then you got the dinosaurs over here that move around and stuff. Yeah. And there may or may not be a Wagasaurus, a Wagasaurus sighting. Yeah. We'll see. Yeah. It's been a while since we've done one of these. Yeah. And uh, I love them. I don't know what kind of animals are going to be in here. Up, we got to go get some food so we yeah. can feed them. And we're with our good friends, Indy and Rob, today. And they came down yeah. from Canada to see us. And then, and Wendy's never been to a drive through safari. No. So it'll be her first. first so it'll be awesome. We're going to have a good time. I to Ohio to do it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, Leslie's going to be a camera operator for most of the day, probably today, because. I'm gonna be driving, so do a good job. Don't mess it up. You're not the boss of me. <laughs> I'll do what I want. <laughs> I can't believe it's already been over two years since we yeah. got our RV mattress by Brooklyn Bedding, and our sleep has been great. Phenomenal. It's been crazy, life changing. Sleep impacts your posture, mm -hmm. your mood, and your overall health. Yes. And when it comes to that stuff, you really don't want to rely on the plywood-like mattresses <laughs> that come in RVs when you buy your RV brand new. Yeah. So we have the Aurora Lux mm -hmm. from RV Mattress with the cooling technology that keeps our bodies at a perfect 88 degree sleeping temperature. Yes, and we also have their cooling pillows, their bamboo cotton sheets, and the weighted blanket. We love it so much that we even got a mattress from my mom. Mm -hmm. And she's loving it too. And she doesn't live in an RV. Exactly. Which goes to show you, you don't have to live in an RV to buy an RV mattress from Brooklyn Bedding. They're for everybody and they come in regular sizes or RV sizes. An RV mattress by Brooklyn Bedding also offers you a 120 night sleep trial, 10 year warranty, and free shipping from their factory in Arizona. The best part of all of it is we can save you 25% all you have to do is click on the link in the description of this video, go over to RV Mattress by Brooklyn Bedding, and type in the promo code WAGS at checkout. What kind of animals are we seeing today? Well, the ones I can pronounce? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> got, we got camel, alpaca, llamas, guanaco, I don't know what that is, uh, sicka deer, uh, Scottish cattle. I don't know what's... 
difference between Scottish cattle and regular cattle. They like to Maybe drink. it's the long-haired ones. They like to drink. I don't know. They're Scottish. <laughs> yeah. Bison. Elk. Uh, giant Elland. Elland. Eland. I don't know what those are. Zebras. Oryx. Giraffes. You gotta yeah. watch out for the zebras. Zebras will bite you. Zebras will bite. Yeah. Emus. Well, they're aggressive too. Gemsbok. It's an oryx, or it's some kind of gazelle. Yeah. Okay. Can we get up to the e emus? I'm going to lock everybody's windows down. <laughs> <laughs> Shut your face. I open everybody's window and they push are, the lock buttons. They're aggressive, no. <laughs> Don't you even think, I saw how you got. If I can't lock myself from an I then I'm going to film everybody freaking out. <laughs> oh, shit, man. Be cool, man. He wants you to feed him, feed him. Don't give him too, too much. You're gonna have to pour it in his mouth. Oh shit! Look Don't lose your cup. <laughs> you probably go. best just throwing some out. There you go. <laughs> oh look, look right beside you. Look, hi, dear baby. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> All right, You're let's keep beautiful. Hello. Bye bye. Right. Bye bye. See you later. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Next time, <laughs> look at the little baby just laying in the road. Hi, baby. What are you doing? Oh, it's a, that this fella coming. Hi, fella. Hello. Dad. Don't spit on me, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how's that? Is that good? That's up close and personal. It is. Hello. I'm going to see if I can get some animal selfies today, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hi. You want to do a selfie? <laughs> yeah. Look at all these guys. They're just like huddled around. Hi. <laughs> A little sneezing and hacking. <laughs> What's in front? Of I them? think they got spotters. They got spotters that'll stand in front of the truck, <laughs> make sure you can't go anywhere. And then all the rest of these guys huddle around. They're like, give you the the little wide eyes. Please feed me. And then you got the guys oh, up here. Guy? Then they swap really? out. A new guy will come. He'll block. Whoa. And more will come. <laughs> oh wow. Oh hey, hey buddy. Aww. Oh wow. You're a big fella. Aww, look at him. <laughs> Hi. He's a Oh man, he's like oh, in the car. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got some white bison coming here. Little guy. Hi. What are you doing, buddy? Hello. Oh, that's good. Okay. Here, let me give you some. Here, I'm gonna throw it on. Here, there you go. On the ground there. There you go. Oh, hey, buddy. You're back, huh? Follow those all. Now you're trying to eat the camera again. Get out of here, guy. What, what are you doing, man? <laughs> oh, I eat the steering wheel. Jeez. Holy crap. Okay, I gotta get out of here. You see yourself in there? <laughs> hey. Look at this. Oh yeah, look at that. Uh huh. That's the good stuff right there, huh? Yeah. yeah. That's all you get. Get out of here. <laughs> Hi! Wow! Because the head windy. Whoa. Yeah, you're a big fella. He's gentle. He's yeah. so gentle. There you go. Oh, yeah, it's good stuff. There he goes. Come get it. Come get this. There it is. Yeah. He's <laughs> so pretty. That's yummy, huh? That's all I got, man. Well, I yeah. don't have that, but I have this. With some grains? Yeah. The other one's coming back too. There you go. He's trying to take the whole cup. Look at him, he's trying to grab the cup out of your yeah. hand. You're smart. He's like, if I can pull this out, I can get the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're coming up to the emus. These guys are generally pretty aggressive. Let's all see right, how, hey. how crazy this guy is. Hi, what? buddy. Hi. Want some of that? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> they peck so hard. Hey, quit throwing it all over the place, man. You're wasting it. You can just grab it and gently instead of being all beaky. Oh, Leslie's turn. Oh, wow. he's really aggressive. Oh, yeah. He's in a hurry. He's like, they're going to move. I got to get as much as I can get. <laughs> okay. 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 <laughs> you good? All right. You done? No. He'll no. eat the whole bottle. <laughs> he, he's going to eat till the, you take the cup away. 
this baby right here, I mean, this baby has to be just, it was probably born within the last couple days. If not, like, today. It's, it's a brand new baby. It's crazy. Oh, yeah, look at that. That is a mess. Oh my gosh. He's like trails of slobber. Yeah. Oh, he was trying to eat the handle there. Yeah. <laughs> Look at oh, that's uh, uh, How'd you like to live back in the day and have this fella come running at you? Of course, he doesn't look too ferocious with, I mean, the teeth wise, he doesn't look too ferocious, but he could probably beat you with that, with that tail with spiky things on it. That probably wouldn't be too fun. Carnotaurus. Oh, but look, the little tea tiny arms. See? If I lived back in that day as a caveman, I would probably get eaten while laughing at this guy <laughs> yeah. for his teeny tiny arms. I'd be like, look at your little teeny tiny arms. And then he would eat, eat my face off. Hey, buddy. Hey. Hi. It's a good boy. It's a good boy. Good boy. Yeah. Hey. Be nice. Be nice. You oh just want to kiss it. <laughs> I want to kiss it. I think if you tried to kiss it, he'd probably eat your face off. No, he would, he would not eat my face off. <laughs> he looks nice and innocent, but if you get up there, he'd get a hold of you probably. Yeah. These giant tortoises, they're like super old too. Except for this little fella. <laughs> He's just a baby. This little guy is just getting okay, started. Wagasaurus time. Is that what it really was? Like size of it? <laughs> you be feeling the desert. <laughs> hey, stick around for a few seconds. We're going to honor a fallen hero. If you want to get involved with helping us help veterans, everything you need to know is right down in the description of the video. Appreciate you watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.